Good morning, listeners. This is Linda from News in Bed with the headlines that you need to know before getting out of bed. Today is Tuesday, November 3rd, 2015. The following stories are from CNN and BBC News. Cheap could cost you more for Obamacare next year. People who buy the cheapest health plans on the biggest Obamacare exchange without getting financial assistance are facing the largest increases to, for premiums and out of pocket costs in 2016, new analyses show. Average costs of the so called bronze plans on the healthcare.gov marketplace are rising 11% for non subsidized customers over 2015 prices. Average deductibles for individuals are increasing by the same percentage to $5,731, according to a study by healthpocket.com, an insurance comparison site. Average premiums for the most popular types of plans, known as silver plans, are going up nearly as much, 10%, for healthcare.gov customers who are unsubsidized, HealthPocket found. Silver plan deductibles, however, are rising more modestly next year by 6% for an individual to $3,117. The Avalier Health Consultancy, in its own analysis, found that the average price of the lowest cost bronze plan on healthcare.gov states was rising by an average of 16%. Avalier said the average price of the lowest cost silver plan was rising by 13%. Compared to the 3.2% rise that was seen for 2015 plans. Erica Hellstrom loves being able to close the door to her office at 3 30 p.m. before heading out for an early evening hike in the deep green forest that surrounds her home city. The 34 year old art director used to have a long and erratic schedule as a freelancer. But she's now based at one of the first Swedish startups to offer a standard six hour day in Fallon in central Sweden. It's just one of a number of Swedish companies trailing the concept, which is part a national obsession with work life balance. For me, it's absolutely fantastic, Erica says. I have more spare time to train or to be outdoors while it's still daylight or to do work in my garden. She has no children of her own but enjoys being able to spend more time with friends and relatives and feels much less stressed since her hours were cut. And those are our headlines for today. Have a terrific Tuesday, and we'll see you tomorrow.